The overall goal of this procedure is to fabricate a sharp polymeric microneedle array, which may provide potential applications in the painless delivery of low molecular and macromolecular therapeutic agents through the skin. This is accomplished by first fabricating a photo mask consisting of embedded microlenses via patterned isotropic etching. The second step is to fabricate microneedle shafts by placing the embedded photo mask over a bath of pre-polymer solution and focusing UV light into the solution through the microlenses, polymerizing the exposed solution. The final step is to fabricate the backing layer to support the microneedle shafts. This is accomplished by placing the microneedles, pointy side up, into a plate, then adding a pre-polymer solution and polymerizing the solution with UV light. Ultimately, the characteristic properties of the microneedles, including length, diameter, and the apex angle, can be observed using a stereo microscope. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods like micromolding is that it is faster, it is mold-free process, and it does not require the use of high temperature. This method can help answer key questions in microfabrications like use of microlens to modify the path of UV light and the polymerization process. This technique can be used to fabricate polymeric microneedles, which are useful for transdermal drug delivery. Although we are only demonstrating how to fabricate blank microneedles, this technique can also be used to fabricate drug-laden microneedles. Begin cleaning a 4-inch glass wafer by immersing it into a quartz tank filled with piranha solution for 20 minutes at 120 degrees Celsius. Then rinse the wafer into distilled...